Find the solutions on the interval 0 to 2 pi for the equation cosine of 2 theta equals radical 3 over 2. Now we can handle this equation like we would for cosine theta equals radical 3 over 2. But because we have a coefficient of 2 on theta, it means we will need to find solutions for two rotations on the unit circle. And once we find our solutions, we're going to need to divide each one by 2. And that will give us our complete list of solutions on this interval 0 to 2 pi. So from what we know of the unit circle, the points where cosine theta equals radical 3 over 2 were in this interval 0 to 2 pi. So we're going to identify solutions in radians. Theta could be at pi over 6 radians or at 11 pi over 6 radians. Now again, because we had a coefficient of 2, we're going to find the next set of solutions for the second rotation on the unit circle. Or you could just think, let's add a full rotation, 2 pi radians, to each of these solutions. That will give us 13 pi over 6 and 23 pi over 6. Next, divide each of these solutions by 2. Dividing by 2 is the same as multiplying the denominator by 2. So our solutions now become pi over 12 and 11 pi over 12, 13 pi over 12, and 23 pi over 12.